Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is the Sunday Shave. This is L and J Shave Crave once again. Yes, I've lagged it, totally lagged it to bring out videos. It's just been very difficult with work and everything, trying to juggle creating a new YouTube channel and you can imagine. But let's get started. So today I'm gonna to bring you the Fine Accoutrements Shave Brush. I believe it is a 24 millimeter stout and white i love it it feels so soft it's a synthetic but it's oh it's just great so we're gonna stick that in the uh red coffee skull let's get that going soaking it up now today we're going to be using the fine accoutrements shave bowl it's actually really Fancy, you can put your brush right here, you can see yeah, the underneath part of it. It says fine. Nice. See? Got your little nubs in there. Nice little bowl. We're gonna use that today. Uh, as far as the soap goes, we're gonna be using Bay Rum by Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements. I hope I say that correctly. It's not an easy word to say. <laughs> so let's crack that open. I'm gonna grab, let's see, I'll just use my finger. Take some of the soap here, spread it on the center right here, like this, to get a good lather, you know? Add a little more accordingly. Just trying to get some in there for the lather. Because this is butter, like this is amazing stuff. Like. I don't know how to put it, but you don't really need that much. Just enough to, to get it going. I think that's more than enough. And uh, let's get to lathering. Actually, before I forget, we're using the Colonel Conk pre-shave oil. Let's see if you guys can see that. Wish my camera would focus a little bit. Something like that. Yeah. Okay. That's what I'm going to be using right now. So let's wet the face real quick. I have a ton of new product coming. I have become addicted to this uh, wet shaving community. And uh, oh well. <laughs> it's fun. It's awesome. It take, helps you take care of your face better. You know? And I ain't complaining, I'll tell you that right now. So let's get a little bit of that going. You don't really need a lot. Because this stuff does amazing work. You know? And this is going to be my shave of the day. I should say shave of the night. While we're using some fine accoutrement products and some Phoenix Artisan products. Uh, okay, yes, I'm rocking my Smith's shirt. Love them. They're awesome. If you guys don't know about the Dr. Strange Records up here in Rancho Cucamonga, y'all need to come and check it out. Greatest place ever. How about a few things there? Went a little nuts there too. It is what it is, gentlemen. I love music, I love vinyl. I love everything that has to do with music. Look at that, that wasn't even a lot and, and you're getting the sick ladder already. Jesus. That's already spilling out of the bowl. Yeah, <laughs> I didn't even get a lot. I love this soap. Oh Lord, look at this. Look at this. Amazing. All right, let's get to cracking. And for the aftershave, I'm going to be using Fine Accoutrements Latigo, I believe is how you say it. It's 
It's not a real thick leather right now. It's not like the last time, but it's okay. This stuff is amazing and it'll do the job. Oh, that really looks nice. That's it right here. Now, I'm using a uh, Phoenix Artist and Accoutrements Safety Razor. It's a little less than 100 bucks, just a bit, just a bit under that. It's a double open comb, already loaded. This thing is amazing. This thing is a very aggressive shave, but I didn't even get one nick the first time that I used it. The knurling on this is pretty intense. Let's see if you guys get that. I'll give you guys the name in the in the description below. So let's get to it. This is by far my favorite one thus far. Cleaning is very easy. First pass on a second use blade. Ah, that's my mom in the background. We just had a little bit of a birthday party for my uh, older sister. So excuse the, the noise in the background. This gives you an extremely close shape. Wow, I'll tell you what, how aggressive this thing is, and I'll compare it to my Mule R41, which is this one right here. As you can tell, the open comb is quite, like, not as aggressive. I mean, I'm going to be real with you. This looks very fine and comfortable, you know? You compare it to this thing, this thing is wild. It's like a freaking comb, bro. I mean, yeah, I understand this is the the, the top of the line right now. Everybody talks about the R41, but uh, I think this just smoked it out the water. I mean, I love my R41. It's a very comfortable shave. Don't get me wrong with that. And uh, I love my R41, but this one, space age, bro. This is this is intense. You know? And there's no tugging. And it gets into those tough spots, you know? Dude, this is my favorite thus far. I haven't even nicked myself once since I got it. This is only my second time using it because the first time I used it was just to test it out to see what would happen. You know, you never know. You know, let's just get a little more soap out of this. Okay. 
Right, let's get the uh, bowl here. Let's get cracking on it. And a little bit of water at the bottom. Should be more than enough. Oh yeah. This uh, fine accoutrements shape was actually now officially one of my favorites. Oh yeah, look at that. Let's go in for the second pass. It's all those sound effects in the background. Apologize. Check this, check this out with you. Look at that. It's like butter, bro. Just look at all that. Look at all. Whoop. Lost a little right there. No worries. I think I got a little reckless with the leather. <laughs> Like I'm eating this stuff, but you shouldn't. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's move that over. Let's wipe the hands right quick. All right. Now let's go for the second pass, but we're gonna go straight up against the grain right away. This is that kind of blade and this kind of safety razor. I didn't even play how smooth this thing is, but you can feel how aggressive it is too. This is probably only going to be a two pass shave, to be honest with you. I've got a super smooth shave out of this the last time. Look at that. Wow. I don't even feel one bit of tugging, not at all. Whew. Wow, just, just as a, it's intense. Wow, no irritation one bit. Dude, this is insane how close the shave is with this. And I'll tell you what, you don't really need that many passes. I'm gonna be honest, I think I'm gonna wash out and call it on this one. Got a little nick, but you know what? I might go over the bottom right quick. But uh, other than the top part, bro, it's just insane. You got such a close ass shave. Um, I ruined myself about right here the last time with it because I was trying to go a different way with the grain, which works for my face, but I'm still new at trying that. But we're going to try it right now. Just 
go slower. My son talking is back in the background. Well, then I showed myself this time. Nice! Wow, ladies and gentlemen. Let me see, I think I have the name of it right here. Right before I close out this video. Now, for the razor, I got the name right here. I'll show you guys right now. Let's see. This is the Ascension. Twist adjustable double open comb safety razor. It's a CNC machined by uh, 3 sixteenths L stainless steel. It's a stainless steel razor. Very heavy, very weighty. Something I do enjoy about certain razors. Um, but yeah, this is it. The Ascension. Even sounds really gnarly. But those 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 combs, bro, are aggressive. But like, look at you. Look what look what you see. Not one nick or cut at all. To finish this off, we're going to wash the face real fast. Oh yeah, oh dude, super smooth. A little bit of ears still, that's all right. Can't stop that from happening. Now, we're gonna finish it off with that aftershave. This is the Latigo by Fine Accoutrements. Mixed with the Bay Rum, I'm gonna tell you right now. Now that's a mix. That is a great mix. There's the bottle right here. Pretty old school looking up. Yeah. So let's crack this baby open. I'm not sure if this has alcohol in it or not, but uh, oh, the smell. It's intoxicating, bro. I love it. Well, I hope your guys' weekend went amazing. Mine went great. It was a little rough in the beginning, but it went great. You know, and uh, I've got some more new products coming. I'll be uh, showing you guys that too. Sorry, I've been lagging it on the uploads. Uh, we tried the double camera thing, and it didn't work as well as I wanted it to because uh, I think you need a better software to make that happen a little easier. It takes a very long time to, to you know, clip in a, a, a frame from a different camera at the same speed as the one you're recording on. It's, it's a little confusing. But, um, so today's shape, you know, we're gonna wash that out right quick. Okay. Let that dry. It was the Atomic Age Bay Rum. Love it. I love this stuff. And we used for the pre-shave a recap on the Colonel Conk pre-shave oil. This came from Fendrihan.com. Great place to shop. I've got a, a few razors from them as well. The Stout 24 mil in awesome white. Does quite an amazing job. And then we use the fine accoutrements shave bowl right here. Yeah. Awesome. That sets right there. Okay, and I have it soaking in one of my favorites, being that Halloween's around the corner, the Crystal Skull by Rad Coffee. And uh, 
last but not least was the aftershave. Never forget, this is awesome. I'd go and grab you, grab you a bottle ASAP. Man, as far as for the Ascension double open comb, awesome. Go and cop one. They're amazing. As you can see, I didn't even get cut once, but it left me extremely smooth. Oh, man. Haven't had a shave like that in a while. Definitely, definitely uh, appreciate that. Well, I hope you guys have a good night. I'll check in with you on another shave of the day. This is LNJ Shave Craig signing off. Y'all take it easy.